Hi, I'm Josh from Best Line Equipment. Today we're going to talk to you about the Hustler Raptor lineup. So today we have a couple of the Hustlers behind us. You have a Hustler Raptor XDX, you have an XD and a Raptor XL. They also make a Raptor X that's for the entry level one. The XDX is going to be the top grade. XD is going to be your middle grade, XL is going to be down towards your lower, and then it goes X. So let's start off with the Raptor XDX. So right off the bat, you notice with this mower, it looks like it's pretty well built. That's because it is. So this is the Raptor XDX. It is a borderline commercial mower. It has a lot of features that some of the commercial mowers have, but it's still considered a residential. With that being said, you have a couple different engine options from Kawasaki. You have a couple different mower deck sizes, 48, 54, and 60 inch. Now right off the bat, you'll take a look at this and you're going to notice that the deck looks a little bit different compared to the two other ones that you'll see later in the video. This mower deck is made out of 10 gauge. It's actually the same style deck as what's going to be on the commercial fast track Hustler unit. They box everything in, they make it out of heavy duty steel. They fabricate the deck and they box the wheels in. That way you have a better, heavier duty style deck on it. With that also, easy adjustment. You use your foot up, down, and you also have a pin lock to choose what cutting height you would like. The other thing you'll notice right off the bat is this one has a little bit bigger tires than the other two. It's because they're 22 inch tires. They stepped it up a, a little bit on the size because this is a bigger, badder mower than the other ones. You also get a high back seat more cushioning on it makes it more comfortable you're going to want that when you're out there trying to cut because this model is good for up to five acres you get speeds right around eight mile an hour out of this unit most of the other ones you're going to be right around seven seven and a half so they give you that little bit of extra speed as well as the upgraded hydraulics on this unit now they stepped up the hydraulics on this unit because you're going to want that when you go out in the field and you're cutting also, they have a full serviceable hydraulic system on them. They have spin-on oil filters. They're just made to actually, you know, get that longevity of the actual unit itself out of it. Again, another great feature with a Hustler is the brakes. There is no actual brake lever on this. When you pull those handles in, yet again, you're ready to rip. So when you go and you get these out into the field and you start actually using this mower more and more, you'll start to see more and more features between the casted parts for the mower deck height, the whole way down to the actual way that everything is designed. It's really thick tube, it's square tubing, very heavy duty. You'll also notice the difference between this mower and the other ones, the way that they actually angle the front wheels on these ones. They do that because that's how they do it on the commercial models. They want you to feel the same way about this model. Heavy duty, easy access, a lot of greaseless stuff on this between the bearings of the mower deck to the actual mower deck adjustments. And they also get to the point where they actually start to put more rigid parts underneath this mower for the mower deck. You have extra bracing going down from the mower itself down to the actual deck. They really are a great all around mower when it comes to the residential lineup. Yes, this is the top of the line version, but you also get a three year, 300 hour warranty on this model for residential use. Your controls are all going to be at the top, very easy to do. Your maintenance wise is the same as every other Hustler mower that they actually produced. They have a cutout on the back for you to drain the oil down through the frame. They also have the oil filter in the same spot. The air filters on top, easy access, spark plugs. You can get your tools right down in there and get the job done when you need to get it done. A couple other things that I will say about this unit. When it comes to cleaning it out, they made thought of that too. You can actually remove this plate here. Once you pull that plate out, you can actually get access down underneath and actually clean everything out. Between the mower deck, you have two top covers you can remove, blow all the grass out. Easy maintenance is the way that they thought of this mower. They wanted to do that amongst all their lineups. Again, this is the Raptor XDX. It is the top of the line residential. Again, comes in 54, 60, and 48. Heavy duty design, residential price tag, commercial style build quality. We sell these here at Mechanicsburg Best Line. We are a actual Hustler Premier dealer and we take care of everything when it comes to selling to maintenance. Best Line Mechanicsburg has these in stock, ready to go out the door. So next we have the Hustler Raptor XD.
With this model, you have a couple different deck options. You have 42 inch, 48, 54, and 60. This is going to be your middle leveled Raptor. It is a good high selling Raptor product. This is probably one of the most common ones that we sell constantly to almost every homeowner. You get the good hydraulics on this that are serviceable with a spin on filter. Also, you still have all the very easy to maintain options on this product itself. You have greaseless fittings on this everywhere. Another thing is that you'll see heavy duty framing on this unit. Again, it carries down or carries up with all the Hustler products. They wanna make sure you have a durable product. With that also, you get a heavy deck on this. You get some reinforcement, anti-scalp wheels on this unit. You also get 20 inch tires. Along with that, this is good for up to five acres if you do use it. Most commonly, most people use it for up to three. Very good unit. You get about seven mile an hour, seven and a half out of them. It's just a very, very good product. It's hard to beat it when it comes to comparing it to every other unit. It's within price affordability. When you actually get on one of these, you feel comfortable, you feel confident, you just want to get your job done. It makes it quick, easy. I'm telling you, you got to try it. I would recommend coming to any one of our best lines and coming in and taking a look at these to actually see some of the differences and some of the similarities between the actual residential product to their commercial products. Again, this is the Raptor XD. It's hard to beat this thing. We sell so many of these, it is very hard to keep a hold of these most of the time. We make sure that the customer keeps getting what they need out of this unit. We have parts in stock anywhere from mower blades to anything to do the oil change, air filter, spark plugs. We keep it in stock. We also have other parts for these in stock. Not only that, we maintenance them, we service them, we work on them. Again, this is the Raptor XD. It is residential with a commercial feel. The next model that we're gonna talk about today is the Raptor XL. This is your just above the entry level Raptor mower. So the Raptor XL mower uh, comes in two deck sizes. You either have 48 or 54. Uh, with that being said, you have two motor options. Both are Kawasaki's. Now, the biggest thing with this mower that you're gonna notice right off the back, compared to the other models, the casters up front are normally yellow. These are black. There's a reason behind that. It highlights a very nice technology that they put on this mower. Those are called flex forks. Flex forks are an actual suspension for the mower itself to take some of the bumpy ride out of it. You still get a nice seat on this mower. You still get the nice foot adjustment for the deck. You still have a very good heavy duty deck underneath of it. What they ended up doing is they made this cost effective wise and cut out a couple little odds and ends, but at the same point, they made sure you had quality and ride quality. That's why the flex forks are on this model compared to the other models. The other models can have that feature added. It's an additional cost, but at the same point, if you want it to ride a little smoother, it's a terrific option to add on. They also do on all these mowers, offer a hitch kit as well as a couple other accessories. Those accessories can range anywhere from a stripe kit to a mulch kit to the flex forks options to they also make light kits as well as baggers and a couple other little odds and ends. But what they tried to do was is they made the Raptor lineup for you residential customers out there and that's why they kind of contour around certain objects to make your lawn look good, make you feel good when you're cutting it, and make sure you're happy. This model is good for up to about three acres. Uh, I wouldn't go too much more than that. You still have a couple of good features, nice hydraulics, nice seat on this, you know, nice stance. It feels good. You still got a nice good set of back tires on this model also for size wise. With that being said, the decks are still good. Again, this is gonna be a greaseless unit no grease fittings on the spindles themselves. It just makes it a very nice model. Hop on, go. And again, easy to maintain that engine. The cutouts, all that are there to make sure you can change your own oil, do your own air filter, do your own spark plugs. It's all there on this model as well. Other things I will mention, if you notice, you still have the heavy duty box tubing. 
it doesn't matter like i said earlier if it's a smaller unit if it's a bigger unit if it's the full you know almost close to the commercial style of that xdx you still have that box tubing frame because of the heavy duty it just makes it a very 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 well built piece of equipment now that concludes our hustler raptor lineup today if you have any questions please feel free to reach out and contact me my name is josh i'm here at the best line equipment of mechanicsburg i'm here to meet all your needs if you have any questions would like to test drive one of these units anything at all we're here to help we want to make sure that you are happy with your purchase as well as your service because like i said earlier we service all these models we have the parts in stock we appreciate you taking the time out of your day to take a look at our Raptor lineup, and we hope that we can help you in your future lawn maintenance needs. My name is Josh, Best Line Equipment Mechanicsburg. Have a great day.